Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna continue working on part 10 of this house build. Let's get started. So in the previous video, we were able to add the pool and then the boundary wall. And here we're gonna continue working on this. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in the gate. So let's go to level one. And then let's copy this, edit type, duplicate. This will be wall number four. And then we just need to change the material again. And let's use materials right here at the bottom. And let's do a masonry again. And something this one. Press OK and then OK. Uh, what I did, let's change it back to level uh, to wall three, and then here, click on wall, and then we want to make sure that the recent wall that we created is being used, and then here we could just add this wall. Um, we should align this right there. Go to 3D and then align it at the top. There we go. And we want to make sure that everything is attached. So that will be good. And the reason that we're gonna split this so we're going to split it from here so that one split and this one as well so we could delete this so this one we need to trim and extend okay that's good and we need to just trim or split again a wall layer so SL just a small wall for the door and this one delete and let's look at it the 3d we will need to create our gate and then before we do the gate we could just extend this so that it's not being shown so maybe around here is good enough and then let's add in some floor edit type duplicate floor number five and then change it to plant Press OK and then OK. And then this one, the plant, it will be around here. I'm just going to use a line. I made a mistake there by choosing that. And then this one will be all around this place. We're doing the background. We could just extend this a bit and extend this. So it, it's up, up to you to extend it. So we need to trim this as well. And click finish. Now, um, more floor. Uh, let's add in add a type duplicate this will be roads so we need something concrete we can choose whatever here
and then we could just add something like that and as you can see here it's not straight at all so I could just delete that and then create a line and then trim So here we created the street, but we could just edit that one and just ex ex uh, explode it, or just edit the boundary and extend it. So I'm just extending that one a bit. Another addition before we go to the gate is we need to do something about the support here. Uh, similar to others that I did, we need a tensile support here. So just a generic model. This will be generic model numbers, uh, number 16 and then this will be from the west elevation. And then it's another extrusion. I will pick a plane, which is this wall. It should be this wall. And just a circle. It will be going in between there. And then we just need to change the material. So this will be a metal material. palladium click finish and then let's before you click finish again you could just extend this one basically showing off the metal and that's good we can feature it like this on our view and then now let's go to our south elevation and add in the gate it's another model in place generic model press ok ok and it's another extrusion i'm gonna choose this wall as a plane so i choose that wall and now I will begin doing the metal and then here we just need this and then now we could mirror this separate this trim that and then do this I will make it beautiful I'm just going to create something like this I'm going to align it at the top I'm gonna click finish but I will just change the materials to another 
metal. Let's use steel, apply, OK, click finish. So we have the steel, but don't click finish yet. We will need to split the face. I'm going to do a split face, which will be on here. And then now we will need to create something like this. This will be something like that. And we just need to copy this. And then mirror afterwards. And then now we could just mirror this from the midpoint. and click finish oh the problem here is we need to do it individual again so that's something that we cannot do that's too much work So I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change this change the setup so I'm gonna create so I'm gonna finish first fix it so go to 3d make sure to fix it first before we do the changes so I'm gonna do half of it like that go go back to south elevation edit this one let's do the same setup so i'm going to do an extrusion again and do this on the side as well For this one, I'm just going to do this. That's good enough. And then copy multiple. I think that's good enough. But here, I'm going to do an opening. So make sure that this is aligned at the top like that and then copy at least some maybe three is good enough so I'm gonna align this one below Yeah, make it simple like this. Mirror it. After that, click finish. Now it's basically open. So there's like openings there. But we're going to cover that with another extrusion. So go back to South Elevation, another extrusion, pick a plane. This will be the plane of this one. So now, instead of steel, we will need to add a wood. A 
apply okay and then now we could basically add this one in between let's leave that one and then here as well just to give it some character and then click finish before you click finish again go to 3d to see what you've done and then make sure to pull it back and something like that okay so now it looks nice And then we should add in some some trees here. So we need to do some extrusion as well. So level one, add in some extrusion. This will be generic model. And then extrusion, we could do is This one first, some curve, we can mirror this, and then here, close it up. And let's do this as well right here. So copy. Let's copy this. And then let's just move this one. So just a quick way of changing it. That's still good. We could do this now, offset it to 50. Or yeah, 50 is good. And now let's trim it. And make sure to change the material. So this is concrete. Click finish. Look at it at 3D. Change something, so around 50. And then don't click finish yet. We need another extrusion. And this one the grass again so in a single generic so keep both apply okay in a single um, extrusion or a model in place you can do multiple stuff like sweep to extrusion or whatever how many extrusion you want but the reason that I always click finish because 
sometimes it's just um, good to finish stuff so that you don't need to get um, any problems and as you can see it's easy to do right here you can even add one here but I think that's too much okay so that's good I'm happy with what it came to you just need to add in more um, flowers um, grass and some trees at the side uh, by the way we need to create a gate here at each each side so what we're gonna do is we need to go to our south elevation but the thing is we don't have the view anymore so maybe this is good enough it's up to you if you want to put a gate on each end or this is good enough so I'll leave it with you guys so let's stop here for now and continue on the next video thank you for watching and hope you liked the video please hit like and subscribe feel free to comment down below